Hi munchkins, I intend you guys are doing well. This is going to be a rant. I'll shout. I'll yell and I'll yell from the rooftops as always. Not as always, I mean sometimes I do rant and some of you love me ranting so here goes. Ellen Watts had once said that you don't, you can't get wet with the word water. The experience of water is different, is distinctively different from the word water right so some of you are constantly asking questions like how many times do i need to affirm how many times do i need to visualize how do you do sats what is the exact way of doing sats how many times did you listen to the subliminal how many times did how long did it take you to manifest your specific person or the money or the job how long did it take you why do you care why how is it helping your situation? This just proves that you do not have faith in the law. And as Neville said it, as Joseph Eli put it, you will constantly have to put it to test. You have to test it for yourself. You have to understand what works for you and what does not work for you. Okay, once in a while you are having a human moment, you ask a question, I get it. But if you're constantly asking questions like, how many times and how long does it take and does this even work? Then why are you here? Why? You're not ready for it. Your entire life cannot be a negative human moment. You cannot constantly say that I am having a human experience. I am having a negative human moment. I am just having a few intrusive thoughts and you drag it, drag it on for the rest of your life and you say that you are actually watching these videos. You have to apply it. You have to apply what you consume. You are constantly consuming content, constantly watching videos. You're constantly hopping from coaches to coaches with no results because you don't have faith. You have to fix your faith first. Not in the coach, not in anything else, but in the fact that whatever you do, whatever you adopt as your technique is going to work for you. What is so difficult? What is so difficult? Apart from you constantly repeating and repeating and repeating the old story, your trauma, your past, your experiences, which absolutely shattered you and you keep going and asking under every damn video and under every Facebook post, whatever that is, even on Insta, how long does it take? How long does it take to work? How long does it take you to feel in power? How long does it take you to kind of really get out of the victim state? How long? That is how long it takes. That is exactly how long it takes. You jump around as a victim all through the day, all through the week, all through the months, constantly feeling like a victim and then you expect to win. That's not the game out here. That's not how the game is played. You win here first and the 3D shifts. It's not, it's never the other way around. It's never the other way around. So you may not, you may just stop watching me for really blurting out the truth, but this is the truth. There's no point asking people whether it works or whether it does not work because it is your experience. It is your journey. It is your decision. As always, it is your decision to win that guarantees victory for you. This game is about mindset. This is a mind game, guys. The more you keep asking questions as, does it work? Is manifestation a hoax? Is it even real? Think about it. Where are you functioning from? Where from are you functioning? Yes, we have human moments. Yes, we have triggers. Yes, people trigger us. But why would you give away your power? Why? Now, you can blame it on your traumatic experiences. You can blame it on people who have hurt you. I completely understand it. I've been there. I've done that. But why would you not acknowledge the fact that this, that this is your life and you are allowed to live it the way you want to live it? Why? I look atrociously angered right now because I am. I am. This is my human moment. But I am assigning it the meaning that I will definitely convey a message that will help at least one of you. What is the meaning that you are assigning to each and every experience in 3D that you are having? 
what is the meaning that you assign what is the meaning that you instantly assign you irritate yourself you make yourself feel like a victim you never really give yourself at least a month to apply the law but you believe that you know the law but you do not apply it you do not affirm diligently you do not do your techniques diligently and even if you're doing them you keep asking others like how long did it take you how long did it take you how long does this take to work think about it where from are you functioning faith or doubt give yourself a month if required give yourself 3 months what have you got to lose anyway what have you got to lose anyway apologies if i if i'm shouting i am actually shouting but what have you got to lose if you absolutely devote yourself to consciously being aware of your thoughts and consciously trying to feel like the person who has whatever you desire to have what is what have you got to lose anyway nothing but the point is you allow yourself you deliberately allow yourself to get into the 3d crap again and again and again and you constantly hold it in your reality and then you blame the law for not working the law is based on what you assume if you assume it's not working for you it will never work for you that is the law and if you assume that no matter what is going on everything is working out in your favor and everything is like divine intelligence is at play to ensure that you get what you want if you assign it that meaning then that is what is going to get manifested in your 3d reality it's just that you have to hold the vision can you can i request you to manage some time for yourself devote some time dedicate yourself to your own mental well being am i asking for too much i guess not i guess not i repeat your entire life cannot be a negative human experience cannot be a negative human moment you have to decide that you are not going to feel like crap all through the rest of your life you have to decide it is a decision nobody can decide for you and nobody will and nobody can i leave it up to you guys i mean i don't i don't see any reason for you after watching so many videos by so many coaches people are really trying to help and assist and support you you watch these videos and you still post questions like can i manifest this can i manifest that yes you can do you believe you can then yes if you think no then no it's not about what i believe or anybody else believes it's about what you believe works for you will work for you right thank you for watching thank you for being patient with me and i intend this was i opening manifestation is about focus what you focus on all through the day you become what you focus on all through the day you become so be very careful of where your focus is going thank you for watching i'll see you soon bye